Komodo dragons, or Komodo monitors, are the largest, heaviest lizards in the world, and one of the few with a venomous bite. These stealthy, powerful hunters rely on their sense of smell to detect food, using their long, forked tongues to sample the air. They can spend hours waiting for a sizable meal to wander within range, before launching a deadly attack with their large, curved, and serrated teeth. The Komodo dragon is an enormous reptile that can grow up to 3 meters long and weigh 150 kilograms. They are incredibly strong and powerful with long, thick bodies, short, muscular legs, and an almighty tail that is used for both fighting and for propping the animal up when it's standing on its hind legs. In today's video, we'll be looking at 8 animals that can defeat a Komodo dragon. Before we begin, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe to our channel, and click the notification bell for more amazing videos. Now, let's begin. Crocodile A fight between these two legendary animals would favor the crocodile, whose powerful traits outweigh the dragons. Even so, the Komodo dragon could easily take on an adult dwarf crocodile, but would not stand a chance against a salty. If the combat were to happen on land, the Komodo dragon is much faster than the croc, therefore able to evade a potential bite. The dragon's agility and ease of movement could come in handy to deliver a well-targeted venomous bite that would slowly drive the crocodile into shock and render him powerless, becoming a well-served meal. However, the tables turn in the water. Other than the size advantage, the crocodile would also have the bite force and speed advantage. The crocodile would catch the dragon in its numerous jaws, crushing it to death with only a single bite, hence winning the match. Alternatively, perhaps the dragon managed to sneak a bite before its inevitable demise during the struggle, which would consequently kill the croc. Anaconda Anacondas are stronger in terms of structure and appearance than Komodo dragons, but Komodo dragons are also powerful because their mouth is harmful and poisonous, unlike anacondas. Both anacondas and Komodo dragons are capable of killing each other. Anacondas can slay the dragon by squeezing it until it stifles and kills it. Internal bleeding may result from squeezing the Komodo dragon. The anaconda would then devour the entire Komodo dragon at once. As a result, Komodo loses the battle with the anaconda. On the other hand, if the Komodo dragon attacks first and manages to bite it, the anaconda will lose the duel. Since the dragon's bite is venomous, the anaconda will die within 24 hours. Tiger Tigers are known for their ferocious outbursts and aggressive behavior, a perfect balance of beauty and strength. Tigers can weigh up to 310 kilograms and have a bite force of around 1,050 pounds per square inch, the second highest among mammalian carnivores, capable of pulverizing bones and shredding flesh with ease. These colossal beasts are known for taking down the largest forest dwellers such as elephants, Gowers, Asian rhinoceros, and even grizzly bears on their own. A Komodo will never be able to defeat a tiger, and even harming one would be a difficult task for him. Even if the Komodo bites the tiger and infects it with poisonous saliva, it will take days for the tiger to weaken and die. There have been documented cases of tigers taking bullets through the chest, stomach, and even face, and still mauling the shooter to death. A tiger is just too big and powerful for a Komodo. The tiger would make short work of the Komodo, ripping it apart in no time. Grizzly Bear The grizzly bear is the second largest land carnivore in North America. They are 3.3 to 9 feet, or 1 to 2.8 meters in length, and weigh 800 pounds, or 363 kilograms. It is distinguished from other bears by the large shoulder hump that supports its massive front legs, its extremely long front claws, and the concave facial profile of its large head. The grizzly bear's fur is usually darkish brown, 
but can vary from ivory yellow to black. It has long hair on its head and shoulders that often have white tips and give the bear the grizzled appearance from which it derives its name. It's obvious that the ursine has the great lizard outclassed in weight and size. Because of the former's massive power and hefty forearms, we can say that, as formidable as the Komodo is, as a close-quarter brawler and wrestler, he won't be able to keep up with his mammalian opponent for long. The bear is also probably more intelligent than the dragon's primitive reptilian mind. Not to mention, even the decent 13 mile an hour speed of the dragon is undermined by the bear's 25. Hippopotamus Hippos are one of the deadliest animals on earth and account for more human fatalities than any other animal, not including disease-carrying insects. They have no predators and coexist among equally fearsome animals like crocodiles, lions, and hyenas. If the hippo got the first bite in, then there is quite a big possibility that the hippo would crush the entire anatomy of the dragon's body in half crushing its skull with a bite force of 2,000 pounds per square inch with ease and the rest of its body. The hippo can open its jaws at a 180 degree angle, destroying everything in its path. On land, the hippo can reach speeds of 30 kilometers an hour whilst running, compared to a Komodo dragon's top sprinting speed on land at 20 kilometers an hour. So, the hippo could actually catch a retreating Komodo dragon that is running away from a charging angry hippo. We don't think it would be wise for a Komodo dragon to even approach the angriest and aggressive hippo. Wolverine Despite its small size, the wolverine is an animal that has earned a ferocious reputation as a top predator in the wild. This species looks like a small bear but the facts suggest it's closely related to the weasel, another small but aggressive creature. The Komodo dragon is at least twice as big as the wolverine, but the size isn't so much of an advantage. Wolverines have been known to take out moose and other prey many times their size. As a mustelid, it is very strong for its size. Sure, a wolverine may not have to deal with large lizards, but it does have to compete with large carnivores like bears for carrion, so it's not like that's a new thing to it. In fact, a Komodo has never had to deal with other predators, where a wolverine pretty much spends every other meal fighting predators to eat. Not saying a Komodo won't win the majority of the time, but a wolverine isn't gonna take it lying down. If a Komodo doesn't get a wolverine in the first attack, it's going to be facing an explosion of strength and fury it's never dealt with before. Lion The lion is iconic, historical and impressive symbol of power and confidence. It is one of the largest, strongest, and powerful felines in the world. Second only in size to the Siberian tiger, they are the largest cats on the African continent. Males grow to lengths of 10 feet, or 3 meters, and weigh from 330 to 550 pounds, or 150 to 250 kilograms. Even if there is a high risk that the lion will die if it's infected by the bite of the Komodo dragon, the latter has no chance of escaping alive as a result of such a confrontation. The lion is far too strong to lose this fight. Alligator Alligators are very large reptiles, with males growing up to 4.5 meters in length. The female alligator tends to be slightly smaller, with a total body and tail length between 3 and 3.5 meters. The tail of an alligator is incredibly muscular and is used to propel the animal when it's in the water. Alligators have short, stocky legs, with webbing between their toes. This not only helps them when they are swimming, but also means they can negotiate the muddy riverbanks with ease. Given the difference in size and a fight with a Komodo dragon, the alligator has a very good chance of winning. Now that you've heard our opinion, we want to know yours. What animals do you think could beat a Komodo dragon? We are waiting for your answers in the comments. That's all for today. 
If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share it with your friends. You can also leave a comment with what you would like to see in the following videos. Thanks for watching. See you next time.